Hello guys, welcome to my channel, Daniel here, and my Ender 3 printer. I just finished my first project and I was so impressed with the results that I decided to do a short video. It doesn't fit here, it's too big, it's upstairs, so we'll go there in a few seconds. Before we do so, I just wanted to mention that to complete my first project, I use about 70% of a blue spool and 70% of a red spool. What you see in the background here is my second project I started last night. This will require about six spools of uh, PLA uh, filaments. So more on that in a different video. So let's go upstairs, have a look at my first project with my Ender 3 printer. And this is my project, a chess set. I put the ruler on the side to give you an idea here. This is 12 inches or 30 centimeters. I uh, did not design the pieces. I'll put the link in the video description. But I could not find a, a good board. So the squares, the board is actually my design. I'm trying here to uh, zoom in to show you uh, the details. So I have uh, uploaded the files for the board. You need also size over here and uh, corners. So I have uploaded the files to uh, Thingiverse. And I'll put also the link in uh, my video description. I thought I would show here what I did. The uh, pieces are six millimeters in diameter. So I cut a piece of MDF board and I painted the sides uh, black. So, and I just uh, used the double-sided tape to stick the squares. It was easier to install than uh, using glue, in my opinion. I printed the pieces and the board using uh, Cura. And actually, I used the settings that I presented in my previous video on the expert menu. Uh, like I said in that video, I got a better uh, finish for the top layer by selecting lines instead of concentric. So I invite you to have a look at that video to see the uh, settings I used in the expert menu.